All right, Spencer, get us up All to right, date. Spencer, catch us up to date. Let's. <laughs> when we last met, the trio had just been regrouping after collecting some treasure in a locker room of a great flying ship. Ascending a magical pole, Sharpie saw a fighting force of Dark Star's evil men. Thinking quickly, the mage conjured a squid, crushing several of the minions. The ship's pilot, the Sinister Dave, played by Jason Sudeikis, <laughs> leapt into action, blinding, tripping, and flatulating on Quark in a flurry of humorous combat. The two fought with knives, and after a ray of frost to the eye and a critical arrow, Dave was slain. The pite-sized armored figure falls onto the floor with a clatter. The dead squid dissolves into air, freeing the previously trapped crewmen. They cower in fear. Go! All right. We did it. So we got these guys on the run now. Yeah. Yeah, so that guy's dead. There's those three other guys. They were, like, trapped under the thing. They're not trapped, but they're just cowering in fear. Are they armored or are they kind of innocent? They're not wearing much of anything. Like, like that whip guy. Okay. Throw Listen to the your podcast. Weapons. I'm saying to them, throw down your weapons. They have no weapons. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 give some, I, I give them some weapons. <laughs> yeah. You give them some throwing knives? Yeah, yeah, I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I, all right. yeah. All right. I give them some throwing knives. And yeah. then throw them down. They, they do that. I go, I go and pick up my throwing knives. And I go, watch it. Yeah. How does that feel to be given weapons and then made to surrender them? Yeah. Not very well. Yeah. Say it again. Not very well. Say it louder. I'm psychologically breaking you. One of them breaks psychologically. <laughs> I drink his soul. You gain three hit points. Oh. Uh-oh. I just went down an L. Ron Hubbard road. <laughs> Oh, you're just a metaphor for d- drug abuse or something. <laughs> I just found out a, a new way so to... We, we don't know what they want, right? No. I no, use, you don't. I use diplomacy. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. So, so what, what do you want to say? Like... <laughs> Uh, I want to say uh, so, sorry about everything. I think. Um, what's 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 going on? What what you what are you doing under there? I don't know how to drive the ship. <laughs> oh shit! Is the ship crashing? You yeah. hear a voice come from the overhead. Autopilot disengaged. Uh oh. The steering wheel of the ship spins wildly to the right, and countless alarms flash, disorienting you. I run. Well, I'm, I... I'm sorry, I'm a ranger. I, 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 I... no. Okay. Do, do, do Range. rangers, rangers have pilot skills? I, I, I run to the steering wheel and grab it. That's you the... grab it. It's very difficult to hold on to the, the terrible bulk of the wheel, but you manage to right its course. Hey, this thing's hard to hold. Can you, 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 you're you stronger than me. Yeah, okay, uh, would, would I do better holding the wheel, Spencer? I, 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 I go and assist and try my luck at holding the wheel and, and steadying the ship. After it's already been steadied by uh, Sharpie, you find it very, very easy to hold it on a steady course. Yeah. However, you don't know where the ship's headed. Ah. Were there some maps in the other room? That's true. You you did you uh, left them there, I think. Okay, I, I I run back to the other room. It, it's, it's safe going, right? We killed everybody on board, right? You're holding the wheel. Uh, oh shit! Uh, hey, uh, hey, uh, hot chat. Uh, go get those maps. I'll I'll, I'll, I'll drive. Uh, Mulrain, mul, mul go get the maps. I, I'm, I... You, I, are you gonna jerk off again? Because <laughs> every time she leaves the room, you start masturbating. I'm gonna use hypnotism to get some information out of these guys. Okay. But, all right, so I'll go get the maps. I'm sorry. No, it's, it's okay. I, I, I bound away, and my hair flows like a river of kisses. And this scent comes from my hair that's like, like lilacs and heaven. And I turn back, and I giggle, and then I walk into the other room. Yep. The sirens are still going off. I look, I look on the panel for anything that might indicate, can I use my intelligence, my extreme Dan Harmon type intelligence to determine if I could tell on this panel if there's anything that will shut these alarms off? There's nothing that will shut them off. They seem to be indicating some sort of pressure regulation warnings. Oh, is the hatch still open? Uh, maybe. <laughs> Which hatch? Uh, the, the, the one I entered through from the that bottom. That one's not open. Oh. That's what about, all I what about the hatches where the cannons were? Uh, those, those were sealed, so. Okay. Hmm. All right, fuck it. Fuck that thing. Uh, if I, if I want to get information out of people, should, as a sidebar, is it better to use charm person or hypnotism? I'd yeah. use charm person. 
Okay, I cast Charm Person on uh, one person. The what guy, the guy whose soul you broke. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> that happens. Okay, is he my buddy now? He he's he's feared of you, but yeah, yeah. Okay. What's your What's your name, buddy? Uh, Clint. <laughs> oh. <laughs> hey, Clint. Well, you, 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 you having a good time piloting the ship? I'm in fear. Yeah? Uh, uh, me too, buddy. We're all afraid. Like, uh, everyone's afraid of things they don't know, but you know it always helps me when I'm afraid? Uh, I, I, l- I, I figure uh, out everything I can uh, about what I do know. It's like, like where's the ship? where was the ship going? I was going to the north to, to regroup. Okay. With all right. them. You know, you know what doesn't help fear? What? Vagueness. What? You know it. You know it always cuts through it. Specificity, like 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 coordinates, uh, like names. Uh, I don't have the education to understand such coordinate systems. Do you have the education to understand that I will fuck your world up? I thought we were friends. Yeah, a good friend will fuck you up. He's broken again. Did ask him, uh, Sharpie. Ask him if he knows how to get the uh, the pressure systems back up, back to normal. How do you get the pressure systems going, Clint? He's bawling on the floor. Clint, crying. Clint, no, no. look at me. I, Clint, I, look I, at me. I step in and play. I, I step in and play good cop. I said, "Listen, sorry about my friend, man. Uh, I want a piece of that asshole." Hey, 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 Clint, I'm sorry about my partner. He's, uh, his wife just uh, was, was, was killed by a cabinet. <laughs> an animated cabinet. Yeah, yeah, an animated... Stupid presidents. Where do they appoint those people? <laughs> They're murderers. Clint, uh, you look, man. I, I, I don't want... I don't want you, you, you've been nothing but doing us favors. Uh, do you know how to stop this... Pr- uh, how to repressurize the ship? You need to find one of those little black creatures. They know how this thing works. Um, don't, don't be racist, Okay, Clint. weird turn. I mean, I'm sorry, they're called imps. Ips? Imps. Imps? I-M-P. What I this? do know how to spell various creatures' names. Okay. What, what deck and how do I get to these, uh, to these uh, knowledgeable imps? They might be in the engine room. All right, I run off to the engine room. You head down the ladder into the engine room. Can I see anything out of the... Is there a windshield? Yeah, there is a windshield. Do I see the other ships? Is there like a fleet of ships? There's actually not. You can't see any ships around you. You find that slightly odd, to be honest. Yeah, we've deviated. Yeah. yeah. I should You're mention that, me. that Quark stepped we away deviated from the we wheel. The... What? The Quark stepped away from the wheel. Oh, so, so grab the wheel. Shit, I grab Go- it. I grab it. He, you, you don't hear him because he's in the engine room at this point. I climb back up the ladder and yell, hey, sorry, I, my, my bad. Grab the wheel, Sharpie. All right, all right, that happens. Boy, I, I, uh, I come running back into the room. Yeah. How does your hair look? <sighs> uh. you do, oh, you did? Oh, wow, you did something new with it. Is that it bangs? <laughs> bangs or rainbows, you tell me. Uh, yes, my hair is flowing, and and my my breasts like they slow motion almost. But then when I, I go back still, into the engine room. <laughs> Sharpie. Yes. Here are the maps. Thank you. You're welcome. There's a musical sting indicating that, you know, I uh, I I too know what it is to be wet. <laughs> Well, I came into the room with my hair up down to here. <laughs> Looked right. into. We don't have time for that. Right. Uh, here, here are the maps. And as a ranger, I know that we need to go north. Also, I overheard you. Should go north. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I just got to keep this wheel uh, straight. <laughs> Sharpie, <laughs> Sharpie, you you got some squid glue goo on your on your shirt. Oh. <laughs> Get that oh, up. Thank you. <laughs> You're such a mess. Listen, make sure those uh, three guys uh, don't move. You know, secure them somehow. Okay. Uh, I, f- I fire two arrows. Jesus Christ. Oh, no, we, need, we, we, we might need these guys. We might need... Th- these are not foes no, right no, now. No, no, no. I, I, sh- I shoot it at their... Uh, is there any part of your body that's not painful to get shot with an arrow? <laughs> I shoot it at their hair. Oh, okay. <laughs> their earlobes? Yeah, oh, through their... They all have earrings. Shoot through their... Well, one of them hits the guy in the eye. <laughs> Terrific. Might have needed him. Might have needed him. The other hits Still you alive. in the foot. Okay. 
You take it. Ha! Uh, adventure! One damage. <laughs> Jesus. I'm sorry. I, I've, I've been very distracted lately. Just keep an eye on them. Uh, <laughs> well, I'll, I'll, I'll take one away, apparently. Meanwhile, in the engine room... I was just going to do that. Yeah, good. Yeah. <laughs> I, I examine the surroundings in the engine room. Whoosh, the engine room slides open. You see eight identical machine, machine-like machine machines. <laughs> they have some vaguely machine-like qualities. <laughs> Pistons firing and tubes going to and fro. You see several fluids pumped through the various devices. You can see one off in the corner. It's venting a strange green gas, and you can see two black creatures crawling across it, hitting it with metal tools. <laughs> Uh, guys, what's going on in here? They hiss at you in a language you don't understand. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, did, did somebody feed you after midnight? <laughs> or get you wet? <laughs> a chatterunga. What did you say, chatterunga? Yeah, I cast magic callback. <laughs> uh... Uh, uh, do I need to? Do, uh, are these? Uh, I, I I approach them to examine the, uh, the the machinery. There's a large crack in one of the casings. That's why it's venting gas. Are You're they not sure what this stuff is? Uh, are they trying to fix it or, or destroy? They do. It? They do appear to be trying to fix it. So I, sh- so, so I, I should leave them to their task, probably, right? M- maybe. Maybe they won't fix it. I don't know. I don't know. I. Uh, hmm. Anybody out there got any ideas? <laughs> whip one at a wall? I take one of them and whip them at a wall. I pick them up with my strength and throw one of them at the wall to send a message to the other one to get on the fucking stick and, and stop the gas leak. <laughs> he falls to the ground and is unconscious. <laughs> And I, I, I look at the other guy, I'm like, oh. The other guy's not paying attention. He's going back to trying to work on this thing. Okay, well, I, I go and assist him. Okay. I mean, he seems like he's doing his job, right? A lot of mixed he asks for some tools. <laughs> look. He, 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 like, looks at you expectantly and hisses something at you. Uh, do, do, I, do I have any ability to, like, to understand him or... Uh... I speak that language. Uh, uh, you know, I, I, I run back upstairs, grab the wheel at the bridge, re- relieve Sharpie, he goes back down into the engine room. You tag out. <laughs> Goldberg style. Yeah. yeah. Go. All right, I'm, I, go, I go to the room. That I, I carefully follow Jeff's directions. <laughs> like, go left. Then, then, then you keep going. If you go to the bathroom and go yeah. too far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Past the, uh, the unconscious imp uh, laying below the wall. All right. The other the... imp is, is hissing about how this was a two-person job. And <laughs> Well, now it's a one-person job. How do we do it? What can I do? I'm a wizard. Well, you, you speak the language, right? Yeah, yeah, you speak the language. So this, 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 what did he say? He's like, I need sovereign glue. Well, this is hardly the time. This is exactly the time. Oh, okay. I Sorry, I was doing a dumb joke. <laughs> Is it is the sovereign glue that big gl- uh, gl- glop of glowing uh, jello that was in the other room with the face bubbling up to it? Uh, hey, you don't know that it's not. Ooh. Wait, what does sovereign glue look like, uh, imp? It comes in a yellow bottle. It's usually well labeled. It should be in the locker room. Oh, the locker! Didn't we get everything out of the locker room? You got all the treasure. Ah. I go to the locker room. You, you go to the locker room. I You're find the it. yellow glue. You do. You find it. Hey! hey! <laughs> <laughs> That's applause bigger than warranted. Uh, well, you found glue? You look at it. They're like, yeah. finish it! <laughs> I got, the babysitter's getting extra. Um, all right, I take the yellow glue back to the uh, engine room. That happens. You give him the yellow glue, and he sets to work. He says, it should be so about five minutes. I think I got this. Five minutes? Yeah. Skip. Thanks, Imp. You know what? You're a good Imp. <laughs> Skip. I, I can see you retiring one day as a, as a, with a happy Imp family, but I guess that's not how Impage works. No. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh, dear. No, it's not. <laughs> all right. 
good day. I, I go back up to the bridge. As you go back up to the bridge, you can't help but flash back. <laughs> okay. You flash back to your mother's tales. <laughs> Son, don't forget the infinite fish who will eat you up at night. He'll fly past the moon in your window and eat you with a bite. Oh, that terrible infinite fish, he'll give you such a fright. That's the last thing you think of before you hear an earth-shattering impact on the hole. Everything goes black. Cliffhanger. Cliffhanger? Cliffhanger. Cliffhanger! Cliffhanger. Spencer, everybody. Dragons! It's hip. It's cool. It's the coolest thing in the world. It's my final revenge on the cool population. I have made Dungeons and Dragons cool. One more time for Aaron McGaffey. And Spencer Crittenden. And a fond fuck you to my gym teachers throughout the years. Turns out this is a fine way to pass the time. Have yet to earn money doing a pull-up. <laughs> Having a pretty good time playing Dungeons and Dragons, Mr. Rainer. 